What's up guys? Welcome to the sweet outdoors. We're outdoors. Today will be a little event. I've got bait bucket full of shiners, full of minnows. We're gonna do a unboxing and use today video. I got the two spinner Ozark trails. I got the two Ozark trail bait casters. We're out here in South Florida at a uh, South Florida Water Management STA. It's a storm treatment water collection place. We're gonna see if we can catch some fish. I hear there's big bass down here. I hear there's I hear there's big fish. Uh, if we don't catch nothing here, we're gonna go somewhere else. We might even make it further down into the Everglades and get some peacock bass. We don't know yet. We don't know what today's gonna bring. Stick around, guys. This is gonna be fun. Okay, first things first. We're gonna try this beast. It was in the last mystery tackle box I did a review on. Now, it's noonish. It is in the 80s. Humidity's down. The water out here is super clear. So, not real sure how good we're gonna do. But we'll see. We might do good. Don't know about this lure. Never used one like this. It's a big loud thing. It's like a whopper popper. If they're hitting top water, it should work. But I don't know. Like I said, I've never used it. Well, I used it a little bit yesterday just messing around with it. But we'll get a couple casts with this and then we're gonna string up the spinner with some shiners. See what kind of action we can get. I'll tell you one thing, when you cast that big old heavy sucker, it sure makes this real scream. over here let's go grab something else guys okay got a shiner hooked up on the Ozark spinner we are about four feet deep let's see what we get here not sure how deep that water is out there we'll see look at that boy swim that's what I'm talking about. That's what you want when you're fishing with live shiner. You want a thing to swim and act crazy. A fish in distress. Well, I'd like it to go a little further out than that. We'll be back. All right, we're gonna walk out on this catwalk. Puts us out here in the water downfall catch a big fish i'll never get up and there's a big fish right there look at that big sucker i hook a big fish i'll never get it up that'd be fun look how beautiful this is out here Right here, boats out in here. Bring your boat in here, get back in all that right back here. That's where big fish are. But this beat's sitting at the house. And I promised you guys a video. Sweet Outdoors films way too many videos on his back porch. We gotta get out more. I'm doing my get my, my, my uh, excuse me. I am doing my best guys. But a lot of times life interferes. Whether it be the beautiful and unpredictable South Florida weather conditions or family matters. I am doing my best. I 
really appreciate all the support that you guys are giving and continue to subscribe with that being said since you're sitting there go ahead like subscribe thumbs up notification you know the deal guys stay tuned one thing there's no shortage of down here big tilapia I don't know if you can see them swimming right across there there's probably about six of them and I've seen I've seen probably about a dozen of them so far only thing is I'm not fishing for tilapia because I don't like tilapia there's also some big gar in here I've seen a couple of them right now it don't seem like there's anything interested we're in about 12 feet of water and I've got the shiner set for about 10 feet so I'm gonna give it a few minutes I'm gonna pack it up and go somewhere else all right we're rigged up different now grabbed another pole rigged up with a minnow I had a bite on the shiner shiner was almost as big as a fish dang it so let's see what we can do with a minnow just trying different locations here seeing what happens stick around okay that's all it took there we go there it is guys fish one nope he's not a monster he's not a trophy he's a fish and that's what we're here to do I say we do it again chasing there he is he's not a big one he's a small one I've seen him going for it he's still playing with it the water so clear and we got him and we had him like I said he was a little he broke my dang line well, we'll be back well we've been here a little over an hour we landed one fish and I lost two. They're all small. I did find, I'm, I am realizing though that some of the line on my pole is frayed. Two of them little fish broke off. Ridiculous. Uh, the action is just not any good out here today. This is a place that has fished a lot to catch the big four and five pounders that they say is in here. You got to get you gotta get out there, out in that with a boat. These places that are accessible by land, bank fishing, they're just, they're heavily fished. So the action is not good. So we're gonna pack it up and venture elsewhere. I mean, to be honest with you, I'd rather fish at the pump house. I catch fish there. I don't like being skunked. So, uh, let's go somewhere else. If you're enjoying this, guys, go ahead and do me a favor. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, notification, thumbs up. You know, I'd really appreciate it. I appreciate all you guys do. I uh, love every one of you. And uh, stay tuned, guys.
All right, we walk down the bank a little bit. We're in another spot. <coughs> Caught two catfish right over there. See where my truck is. Now we're over here by this structure. See if there's anything else in here besides prehistoric damn catfish. They are fun to catch though. I wouldn't eat nothing that big anyway. Ugh, can you imagine? I do not know how much longer we're gonna be out here. All that weather right there, it's coming this way. The fish are not biting. Got a shiner on the bottom and it ain't doing anything. Got the minnow out there on this other spinner and the gar keep messing with my bobber. So we won't be out here much longer. All right, guys, we're home. The action really didn't pick up anymore. Caught one more catfish, about yay big. <coughs> Wind picked up really bad. Overcast, got just real nasty looking. So, bring it back home. Going to throw some chicken wings together. Hydrate. And see what tomorrow brings. I didn't get to use any of the stuff in the mystery tackle box. Didn't even get to open it. So I'll do a mystery tackle box unboxing for you. But I had a good time. Got out of the house. Got outside. Got to do some fishing. Caught some big fish. Hope you enjoyed it. Like, subscribe, notification, thumbs up, download, share. <coughs> Over to Facebook. Check us out on Sweet Outdoors. Really hope you enjoyed it, guys. Be safe. God bless. Get outside, people.